Frightened and confused, these young children are led to safety and reunited with their families after a mass shooting in their school killed three of their classmates and three teachers. Among those killed, two nine-year-olds, an eight-year-old, and three adults, including the head of the school. Police say the suspect was shot and killed by officers on the scene. 28-year-old Audrey Hale was a former student at the school called the Covenant School, part of a Presbyterian church. Police say in this surveillance video, you can see the shooter, 28-year-old Audrey Hale, blasting her way through a side door at Covenant School. She is a former student here. And later, you see her roaming the halls looking for victims. Police eventually shot her dead. Hale was armed with these two AR-style assault weapons, which were apparently legally purchased, along with this handgun. Police say they also found writings which point to a motive, although they aren't ready to share it. We've also determined uh, there were uh, maps drawn of the school in detail of uh, surveillance, uh, entry points, etc. Uh, we know and believe that entry was gained through shooting through one of the doors uh, is how they actually uh, got uh, into the school. President Biden decried the shootings. It's ripping our communities apart, ripping the soul of this nation, ripping at the very soul of the nation. And we, we have to do more to protect our schools so they aren't turned into prisons. Biden again called for a return of the nationwide ban of assault weapons, which existed for 10 years during the 1990s. But Republicans continue to resist. In fact, the Republican congressman who represents the Tennessee district where the shooting happened once tweeted out this Christmas greeting, a photo of himself and his family members holding assault rifles. Andy Rosgen, TRT World.